What's up guys? Got another Cyrax video today. This time, you trolls took everything from me. So, let's check it out. You know, I was laying down in bed and I felt like I needed to make this video. To better explain to you fucking trolls just what it is that you did to me. When you guys decided to attack me and harass me, you didn't just put me down. You didn't just spread rumors and lies about me. You know what you did? You ruined a career that I had built over 10 years. A racing career that I was slowly building. Something that I can be proud of. A legacy that my older brother left behind for me to carry on. I started racing because of my brother. He's the whole reason why I started racing. Cyrax, you can't drive. And I don't mean like in real life, I mean even in video games. You're the worst driver in the fucking world. I set the world record on Need for Speed Underground 2 about 5 to 6 years ago. And that video footage is what put me on the radar of people to watch out for as far as setting records go. That put me on the radar of some of the pro gamers out there and some of the record setters. So what did I do? I continued that legacy on. I continued that whole thing going. And then I got into Forza Horizon 4 in 2018. And from there, that's when my true career in racing took off. I began getting better and better and better. Every day. Working my ass off. Day in and day out. Busting my ass. And then I got to the point where I went up against some of the best like Slap Train. And several other people that I looked up to. Never fucking happened. You never went up against the best because you are the worst. And then over the last couple of years, I started to go pro. I started to get sponsors on Twitch for racing, doing comps, doing drift comps, doing rally events. Doing my own thing, building a career that I could be fucking proud of. And then what you guys do? You guys ripped it all away from me in a matter of fucking, in a matter of minutes. Do you guys even realize that I have not raced once this whole fucking year because of you guys? Because of y'all, I've not been able to get. I'm not being able to get behind the wheel at all this year. Uh, that is absolutely a lie. You've been on kick, racing, playing your stupid games, showing everyone how you crash all the time. You've been doing that fucking a lot this year. Because no company wants anything to do with me because of all the lies that you guys have fucking spread about me. And it's really affected my career. Not just with racing, but with music also. Because of you guys, the label I was on fucking dropped me. Every time I go to make some sort of money, you guys rip it away from me. And that's not right. You know, you guys think you know what hard work is. You don't know what hard work is. Until you're sitting there 
beating yourself up when you win, when you lose just one race you beat yourself up wondering what could I have done better I don't usually consider hard work and playing video games to be the same fucking thing you don't know what it's like to put in the blood the sweat the tears that I've fucking put into everything I've ever done. All the hours of watching hundreds and hundreds of videos on how to get better, how to properly tune your car, how to do this, how to do that, how to properly hold an angle while doing a drift, how to properly initiate a drift on a proper sim rig, how to actually fucking do shit. And constantly getting better. Y'all really don't understand that. This whole year I've been sitting here depressed as fuck. Because of you guys. Every one of you. has now made it to where when this is all said and done I'm going to have to work my ass off from the ground up once again What the fuck are you talking about? You're nowhere. You've made zero dollars from this. You don't, you're already at the ground. You already have to work from the ground up. You have nothing. Y'all don't understand the hard work that it takes to compete on a high performance level like I have. You guys don't understand the amount of time and hard work that it takes. You guys don't know what it's like to carry on a legacy that somebody left behind for you to carry on. You guys don't know what that's like because you guys have never had to fucking deal with that shit. You know, you make a lot of fucking assumptions about everybody when you haven't left your fucking attic in 10 years. But I have. Every single day, I think about my older brother and the legacy that he left behind for me to carry on. But yet, I'm not allowed to carry on that legacy because of you guys. Y'all really don't understand. This whole racing thing for me, it ain't just a fad, it ain't just a career, it's my fucking life. No, what it is, is you like to play video games, and you say, oh, well maybe I'll just make that my career, and pretend it's my job, because I really like to do it, even though I don't make money from it. It's everything I've ever known my whole life. All I've ever known my whole life is racing. Everything from watching NASCAR on TV as a kid, to the Fast and Furious films, and then to actually getting into actually doing it. You don't do it. Stop pretending like NASCAR and the Fast and the Furious is exactly like your little Forza game. You're playing a video game. You're not driving. Racing's in my fucking blood. It's who I am. It's what I do. And what I want to know. What I want to fucking know. Is where do you asshole trolls think that it's right for you to do what you fucking do to me. Rip everything away from me that I've built up. Why? Why rip away everything I've built up? 
What, just so you can get a few cheap fucking laughs? Is that it? Is that why you do it? To get a few fucking cheap ass fucking laughs? You guys really don't understand the hard work. You guys don't understand. Every time I get behind the wheel and I'm competing and I'm doing my thing and whether it be me having fun with my team drifting around on different tracks whether it be competing you guys don't know how often I think about my older brother why do you think I'm so fucking proud to represent the number 23 on all my cars why do you think the number 23 means so fucking much to me it isn't just another number. No. That's my brother's birthday. January 23rd. You know, it was 43 a while ago because that stupid racer who died. So I think you're just making it up as you go along and pretend it means something to you. Like every other stupid fucking thing. So when I put the number 23 on all my cars, that's not just me putting a random number on, no. That's me showing that I'm proud to carry on my brother's legacy. That shows that I want to carry on his fucking legacy, and I still want to do that. I just wish you fucking trolls would leave me the fuck alone. And stop all these bullshit ass lies that y'all know ain't fucking true. Racing's all I've ever known. It's what I love. It's my passion. It's what I've worked my ass off to build into a career. And like I said, I had a career on Twitch, competing on a pro level with sponsors, doing good for myself. But yeah, what happened? You guys sat there and you fucking ripped it away from me. All for some cheap fucking laughs. You guys are fucking pathetic. You know, I would love to see you guys put in the hard work that I put in. Because I know damn well none of you motherfuckers have got the goddamn balls to do it. You know, just yesterday I was digging through an old email address. And you want to know what I saw? Over 20 plus sponsors. Fucking turning me down because of the lies and the rumors that you guys have spread about me. Sponsors turning me down, companies that I was sponsored with letting me go. All because of the fucking rumors that you guys have spread about me. You've never had real sponsors. This is just made up shit in your head. You've never made money. You never actually had real sponsors. You never had a career racing. This is just all bullshit. And you guys really don't understand how hard I worked to get those sponsors, the hours I put in, the hard work that I did, all the training, all the practicing, the 
the the sleepless days, the sleepless weeks, going one to two hours a week on sleep, busting my ass. You guys really just don't understand what it takes to be a professional driver. And quite honestly, I don't think any of you ever fucking will. And you know, and it fucking kills me because I want to race. I want to compete so bad. But I'm not allowed to because of you stupid ass fucking trolls doing what you do to me. Every time I make some sort of money doing something I'm actually good at, you guys rip it all away from me. And then you sit there and go, ha 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 ha. We took something away from you. No, we believe you're this, so you're not allowed to make money. And it's fucked up. I don't deserve this. I don't deserve to be ridiculed. I don't deserve to be bullied. I don't deserve to be harassed. If anything, I deserve to be left alone. And I deserve to be able to do whatever the fuck I want to do with my life. Whether that be Twitch, whether that be YouTube, whatever it is. I deserve to make a living doing what I want to do. I shouldn't have to bow down to a bunch of fucking pussy ass fucking trolls. And that's why I'm going to fight this shit. And believe me when I say it, come hell or high water, I'm going to take my fucking career back that you guys have stole from me. And I'm going to make that climb again. And this time you motherfuckers ain't going to stop me. Alright, good talk Cyrax. I'm sure this time all the trolls will just leave you alone because you'll whine some more. But uh, yeah, thanks for watching guys. Have a great day.